Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's look at the problem twenty-five in chapter twenty-five. Chapter twenty-five is about electric currents and resistance. So there, right? We can see we have a length of a wire cut in half, and the two lengths are wrapped together side by side to make a single wires. Ask you what is the resistance for the new combinations compared with the origin one? So there, how can we do that? We can consider the origin one as the number one, the final one as number two. Okay, this is a wire one, wire two. As we can see, it cut in half, cut in half. So that makes the L one over L two equal to two. Do you agree? Yes. And also, it、uh, in this case the volumes is constant, right? Because it's a cut in half and then put them together. So the volume is constant. So make the cross sectional errors A one times L one equal to A two times L two. Do you agree? Yes. From this equation, we can get the ratio for the cross sectional errors a one over a two. Agree? Yes. So from this one, we can say a one over a two equals to l two over l one from this function, from this equation, and l two over l one is one over two. Agree? Yes. Now you need to find the resistance changes, right? The resistance ratios. So as we consider, the resistance can be connected with the length and the cross sectional errors a, right? So initially, resistance is rho times l one over a one. Final resistance is l r two equal to l times l two over a two. Agree? Yes. Now you can see we can find the ratio r two over r one. You input R two inside, R one inside, rho rho cancelled. So this can be simplified as this term, and input the L one over L two, A one over A two inside. You get the final answer there. Thank you.